We start in San Anju, where officers attached to the drug squad unit discovered a rifle in a dwelling house located at Grambar. Investigations are ongoing. In an unrelated matter, 27-year-old Delon Edwards of Richmond St. Andrew was arrested and charged for possession of a firearm and possession of ammunition. A pistol and four rounds of ammunition were found in his possession. Edwards was charged by officers attached to the CID Grenville Police Station. He was granted bail in the amount of $7,000 with one surety and is scheduled to appear in court on January 21, 2022. In other developments, the police report that sometime after 2 a.m. on Thursday, 13 January, officers attached to the drug squad unit intercepted a blue and silver Suzuki Escudo along the Grand Dance Valley Roadway, a search which revealed a quantity of controlled drugs. The cannabis weighed 167 pounds and carries an estimated street value of almost $400,000. Police have charged several persons in connection with the drug find. They include Karen Shrika, a 31-year-old chef of Grandans Valley, 30-year-old Tyrell Barry, an assistant chef of Mount Fendu St. Patrick, and Lauren Charles, a 30-year-old fisherman of Brighton Village, St. Vincent and the Grenadines. The vehicle was also impounded. An additional charge may be laid against the Vincentian National, who entered the state of Grenada illegally. One of the men also tested positive for COVID-19. In an unrelated matter, Nanzani David and Victor Vespri, who were charged in connection with the discovery of 114 pounds of cannabis on Saturday 8 January 2022, were remanded to custody at Her Majesty's Prison following a drug bust at Rotten Beach St. Patrick. Further to this seizure, Crispin Ramdeen of Snellall St. Patrick and Anthony Jones of Rukin St. David were arrested and charged on Wednesday for trafficking in a controlled drug following the discovery of nine pounds of cannabis. They appeared before the Sutter's Magistrate Court today and were remanded to Her Majesty's prison. All five men are scheduled to reappear at the Sutter's Magistrate's Court on January 25, 2022. I am Gerard Joseph for GBN News.